Hey everyone, it's Robert. So I've gotten a ton of requests to do a Yoru lineup video for Breeze. And after playing a lot of Yoru on Breeze, I think it potentially can be one of his best maps, especially the B site. So let's get started there. And as I'm showing you guys all these lineups, I think it's really important and it would help you out a lot if you actually paid attention to and like watched how the teleporter paths exactly. For example, if I'm sitting here on B and I know somebody's yeah. playing close left, you know, I, I know that if I throw this teleporter out that ends up yeah. back site, they won't see it or hear it and I can get behind them without them knowing. So just really pay attention to how it paths because that can really be the difference between you winning and losing a round and also deciding on which lineups to use. So the first lineup that we're going to do is just from this window. Now, if you look, you can actually throw it from this windowsill. You don't even have to aim down. You can just throw it from this windowsill and just literally just aim backside. It's super easy. It's going to come through. See, this guy to the close left won't hear it. You can just TP back. And nobody will know unless somebody was playing right here on pillar. This next one's pretty simple. You just want to get up against this wall here and then just hug this wall until you don't see this wall anymore. And then throw it up against this back wall right about the middle here. It's pretty simple. Here. And get you all the way back into their spawn. Now, there is a teleport lineup that gets you back into spawn, but it's more so whenever you're already pushing onto site and you want to catch the people rotating over from A. So, like, let's say you kill the guy sitting on close B and you guys are pushing onto site. You're not going to have enough time to, like, sit out in the open and line it up. So, just kind of, like, get a feel for how to do it quickly. You want to get in this corner right here next to this pipe. You should be able to feel it on the wall. Again, this is when you're going to have to do really quick. And then aim in between the corner of this wall and this vine it's right about there. You guys are planting or whatever. You guys are getting the bomb down. Your teleporter is traveling. And you're all the way in their spawn. And you can catch the people rotating over. This next one's going to get you from B main all the way here. to top mid. You're just going to go up against the corner of this box here. And then aim, aim in between the corner of the wall and the orb. Time to jump. Throw it out. And of course, there's the lineup that goes to backsite right here, but it's really not that hard to hit. It's super obvious. Just literally stand anywhere. Go to, on this wall right here. You guys know that one, though. Yeah. Another way to get backsite through mid is you want to stay on top of these barrels here. Now, again, you have to have like this smoked off or somebody covering this window. Maybe like the sage walls you yeah. off and B main, but you still want to get yeah. to backsite. You would come on top of these barrels and then aim on this first brick booking out of the wall here. gonna curve and get you all the way back side so the first one that i have for mid you're gonna want to hug this wall here line yourself up with this line on the bricks right here and then you'll see this vents on the ground right here aim the teleporter on the space between the vents in the corner of this wall it's not that precise, it's easy to go for mid. And this one's really good if you have your team pushing through a cave or if you have like fake footsteps coming out of cave and you're like faking a while your team goes b you can tp back here and you can usually kill the guy playing pyramid. This next one's really good if you can pull it off correctly. The only thing about this one is that you have to cross over mid without being detected. So, you know, whether that's through a flash, whether you have your teammates yeah. smoke it or not, however you want to do it. You want to get here, though. You kind of want to do it quickly. Line yourself up with this plant on the very left and then aim in the middle of where this shadow is on the wall. Throw it out. You know, what I would do is like maybe drop some footsteps. You know, to go all through. It's going to get you into their spawn. So make sure you're not peeking out of this door mid. And just let it travel for a bit and just stay safe. TP back behind them all. Activate your footsteps and take care of the guys on site. This next one's pretty cool. You know, what I would do is like maybe drop a Decoy. footstep or two. Decoy. You know, really sell that you guys are doing a mid push. Time to jump. Just get in the corner and then aim at the graffiti of this wall. And it's going to take you all the way through. It's going to get you to the back of B site. And as it's traveling, you know, maybe activate your footsteps. Get the people on site looking mid. And then TP. So the first one for A side that I have is up here in hall. The round's gonna start. You get all the way in this corner and then aim at this door all the way at the end of hall, right about here. It's gonna go all the way through. You know, really use your footsteps to get a lot of these teleports. You know, that's how you convince people and actually get behind them. It's gonna go through. It's gonna get you into their spawn. So a lot of the ones on A site are pretty obvious, but this one gets you from cave all the way yeah. into their spawn. Now it's a little precise, so pay attention closely. You'll see these two canisters on the ground right here, and then you'll see this big rock. There's a hole on this rock right here, and if you line yourself up with the center of it, and then on the pyramid, there's like this line going down the left side of it. Just aim at that, Time throw it out. It's gonna go through. Like I said, this one's a little precise, so it might take some practice. Hit these boxes. 
and get you all the way into their spawn. There's another one in the same exact lineup spot. Instead of aiming at this line of the pyramid, you're just going to aim at this door here. It's going to path the exact same way. And it's going to get you underneath this bridge area or like behind this staircase. And the other ones for A are pretty obvious. Like, you, I mean, it's just a big open door. You just throw them back sight here and it gets you here, you know. So that's really the only one on A worth mentioning that you guys probably don't know already. So starting with defense, this one's really cool. Probably one of my favorites on Breeze. This one's really, really, really precise. And I'll show you why. But it's going to get you from the back of B site all the way to the back of cave right here line yourself up right where the brick and the top of this grass meets right here you're going to be aiming at the center of this little window on the wall right here so right about there you're going to throw it out to jump. now the reason why it's so precise is because it can get caught on this right here and if it does then it just stops and just tracks but if it doesn't it keeps on going and it gets you all the way right behind everybody in cave there's another line up here that's around the same spot line yourself up with this brick and grass and then instead of aiming at the center of the window you're going to aim right at this brick in between the window and the wall here to and it's going to get you from b main all the way yeah. into their spawn there's not really any lineups for mid when it comes to defending so we're just going to start with hall next you can actually throw your teleporter through the chute down hall here and you can also throw your footsteps literally just aim anywhere on this wall here you can do the same with your footsteps and it'll go down now for a site the first one that i like to do is if maybe i'm playing bridge you can also do this one from stairs over here the main objective is to get your teleporter over into this corner right there from bridge you can just aim it at this wall anywhere and it'll go down pretty easily stairs you can do the same thing be careful not to throw it down this way because it will get stopped by the wall right here but i like to throw into this corner over here and then snipe from stairs and then right when they think i'm playing stairs maybe throw a flash out and then tp to the other side and then while they're looking stairs peek out and get a kill the next one you're going to come over here on a site and get in the corner of this fence in the wall right here and you're going to aim right in between these two metal sheets on the wall it's going to get you from pyramids all the way yeah. to their spawn side a bit more risky because usually people see this one but it is possible you can TP whenever. I stream almost every single day on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash robertrayhart underscore. I've also already posted a bunch of Yoru videos showing some of these plays in action, so be sure to check those out as well. Subscribe and like if you enjoyed. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below and I'll answer every single one of them. Thanks for watching.